Well, Shasta County appealed the decision not to go into the purple tier, but the state did not approve that request. Well, Shasta County Supervisor Les Ba joins us now. He made the motion to stay out of the purple tier. Les, thanks for joining us. Um, explain what the motive was behind your motion. Well, it's really simple. Um, the businesses that are being impacted the most are the businesses that are not the source of any spread. Our local retailers and our restaurants, our own Shasta County information, complete with public health information, as quoted at today's meeting, uh, shows no spread at our local businesses. And yet, they're in the purple tier. They can't be opened at all. So, the reason. as we understand, we're speaking with uh, Shasta County Supervisor Les Ba right now. Shasta County is now in the purple tier, the most uh, restrictive tier. What options do you really have, though, legally? What, what's the next step for you? Well, the board is free to set whatever options it wants to. I, I don't know that, that we're going to be able to come together and find something that's reasonable. Uh, but we do not have to follow the state mandates. We can step out of those. We can create our own guidelines. Would there be repercussions? Chair uh, Rickard is correct. I heard her report just a few minutes ago. There would be financial repercussions. But what about the $500 million financial hit to our local businesses? We've gained $20 million. Our local businesses have paid a half a billion dollars. Is there a financial responsibility there? Yes. All right, Supervisor Baugh, thank you so much for taking time out to clarify that.